Hola, Hola amigos. What's up? What are you doing? I think everything sounds so quiet. This is a banger, this song. What's up, Rusty Acres? My brother. FS Farmer C. Rev. Joe. Midwest Farmer. R R Rusty Acres again. <laughs> Pleasant View is here at 11.30 in the morning. What in the world's going on there? Jay Graham, what's up? Landon? What's going on, everybody? How we doing? How was your weekend? Uh, we're going to turn on. Just to make things go a little bit easier. Turn that off. Um, we're also going to turn the music down a little bit. Oh. I'm doing good, Landon. Yeah, thanks. How about you? Hey, no, Tegan. Hey, Rick. It's good to catch your stream for a little bit last night. I was lurking for a while while I was uh, doing some recording and stuff. So I was there, even though I didn't chat a bunch. I was there. Aaron Jenkins, hello. Happy Tuesday to you. Oh. You don't want to go. Uh oh. Oof. The old 43 don't, doesn't want to pull. Come on. What's going on? Why don't you want to pull this? She a bit underpowered? We're just spinning. We're just spinning, boys. Come on. <laughs> she didn't want to pull. We I have that's the first time we've had that issue. Must be a wet spot in the field or something. Off topic, but today they are showing Oh, very nice. I'm excited for the show. Well, I'm no longer lost outside of Detroit in the dark with bad... Ch uh oh You know, Detroit isn't the best place to be lost, Jesse. Just, uh, just a heads up. <laughs> yeah, I think it was the first time actually being in your stream there, uh, Rick. Good to chat with you. It goes to server fun. Haven't really done it much. No, I'm not using manual attach, Tyler. D21 would definitely pull that puppy. We, sh we should probably get ourselves a D21. <laughs> I did learn that, yeah. Spinning holes. I know, Geeson, we gotta, we gotta not be tearing up our grass field. We need this grass for our coos. Your problems. Yeah, that's true. That is true. 
I bet you, I bet you if we got the 1066 down here, it'd pull her out just fine. All right, so we're going to try and turn right like uh, Pleasant told us to do. The red one can I'm sure it could have. I'm sure it could. We actually, we're going to go check on the red one quick because it's probably empty. Oh. Oh, we didn't turn the... We didn't turn that one on. Shoot. How we doing, guys? Nobody told me about their weekend. You guys must have uh, not had anything too crazy going on. Hey, Monty. Did they catch you at a slow time at work? Are you just uh, not working today or what? Thanks, Williams. Yeah, I, I like it too. All that just to buy a sister. You're buying your sisters, huh? That doesn't, uh, that doesn't sound right. Did you get it? Did you have a mistype there, Jesse? It's good steer. All right, good deal. Yeah. <laughs> uh, weekend was too short. It's always too short. Uh, my weekend was busy, packed with dealing with Amish on building barn. Oh, yeah. Are you talking real Amish or are you talking in game? Oh, Aaron Ashlock with the $10. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate the big tenor. Thanks, Aaron. Always good to see you. I'm, hey, it's going good for me. Just. Having, I'm having a good week so far. Yeah, it's been good. Let's see if we can get the deer to pull this one. Oh, we don't want to take the head off like that. Little time right now before I got you, Monty. Kind of disappointed that we can't get that chopper box going or pulled with this. I don't know why. I was just doing a little bit earlier to speed up this process. And, uh, yeah. It wasn't going. Auto crick sound like <laughs> all that to just buy a sister. What kind of skid steer did you get, Jesse? Man, my 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 buddy Kyle, he got himself a skid steer. That thing is sweet looking too. I don't know if he's posted any pictures or anything in his Discord, but old Fairview Farms went out and bought him a skid steer too. Well, yeah, we had to turn left right there because we're trying. I mean, you can't always turn right, right? Kind of hard to always turn right. Oh, I thought I swear I made a. Oh, it's over here. Oh, we'll just drive this back, I guess. Pretty uneventful weekend. Made a bit of progress. My old cars, which will need to be. Can you come out of the barn for lambing pens to go? Oh, very nice. 
Sounds like a good weekend, Rev. Getting some, getting, making some progress. Always good. I got you, Tyler. I figured, I figured that's what you were talking about. Hey, Sim started a big farm using an X9. Very nice rubber duck. I have not yet used an X9 in farm sim. I just always tend to go with like the smaller stuff. Because my intent is always to... Uh... You know, start small and grow big. But it, never, it never works. I don't feel like I ever make it long enough. Although I'm feeling Elma, man. I'm feeling Elma is going to be it. We're gonna we're gonna get ourselves some big stuff on Elma. Picked up a teleskid. 124 hours train. Ooh, teleskids are sweet. Got that extended boomer. I bet that's pretty handy too, isn't it? Is that a JCB? Because I've only ever heard of JCBs as the only big teleskids out there. Oh yeah, Jesse, he's a Canadian, eh? Oh yeah, he's a Canadian, eh? Alright, let's go see if the 1066 can pull that uh, Gale Wagon out. Hey, Logan Osman, happy Tuesday. Morning. Tuesday morning, it should be morning for all of you guys, unless you're in the UK. Still got 17 minutes left of morning here. Hey, Ethan. Happy Tuesday to you as well. Good to see ya. Yes, I'm, I'm, I, well, I was sad about the loss, Tegan. Oof, we got ourselves, we just got her right in a wet spot right there or something. But, the mighty 1066 doesn't have a, no issues pulling her out. She's a beast. She's a beast. Most time you haven't just messed around on a random... Nope, I have, I have not. I have not. Have you? You've done that before? I haven't. I don't know why. Yeah, I know it. It does sound like that dairy thing is going is 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 what's uh the winning the winning formula but I just I don't know dairy farm their dairy work is just so much to keep everything fed Although I am thinking, when we get to the point that we are gonna build or buy the dairy farm on Elma, I think we're gonna tear it all down. We're gonna sell the buildings, and we're gonna put ourselves up a bigger feedlot expansion. Kind of move more into a feedlot instead of like pastured cows. Thinking that's probably what we're gonna do. The old JCB Telesister. <laughs> Almost the best thing going on. I want to see it. I'm thinking it's going to go for a long time, Jesse. Yeah, I am. I'm thinking it is. I have high hopes for it. 
This next year is going to be a grind on it because we have a lot more acres with the field that we just bought and our equipment's still kind of small for it. So it is going to take a while to like do jobs, but mostly like harvesting. I'm thinking it's just going to take a while, but I think the year after we're going to make ourselves some big time money and we'll get ourselves some bigger stuff. Yeah, Rusty, we actually have a server. We have a multiplayer server that just went up last night on it. Was it last night or the night before? Last night, maybe? And uh, we got like nine. I think when I was on there last night, it was a total of nine guys. And it is amazing how much better that server runs than what we were do than what it, uh, Tahitian ran. For me. Like, I can be on... Like, I was on there last night... And it was like seven o'clock. And usually that's like when I was trying to get on the Tahitian server and I just, it was unplayable for me. But on that map, I think it was the map that was causing all my issues. On that map, I'm running like 35 ping and I'm doing great at busy internet time. So I'm pumped. I'm all about it. That's the 66 pack, Blake. Oh shoot, we figured ourselves a full wagon. How long have we been full for? Of course it's gonna work better. <laughs> Oh jeez, we did oh jeez, we got ourselves a backup at the at the silo. This is the one thing. We have to make sure that we're dumping these because it's it's too narrow in here for auto drive. It's, there's too many collisions. Or it's gonna work better than that hayfield painted lead sinker. <laughs> That's one way to describe it. Hey, John Tompkins. Hello. How are you? Benny, what's up, brother? Happy Tuesday. Hope you're having a good day so far. Hello, Sim. 446 Irish time. Listening on my commute home from work. All right. Hey, hope you had a good work day. Bob. Appreciate you tuning in. Hopefully you don't, uh... You stay safe out there. No reason to be watching or listening to me while you're dri are you Are you driving? Surprised you got my updated Glenier. Yeah, Jake. I did. Yes, sir. Why are you surprised about that? I mean, their Pleasant View's, uh... They're Pleasant Views Combine, so obviously they're good. They're just, you know, rebranded, which is kind of cool. They have more options. Gosh, my eye is just so bad. Trace. I'm doing good. How are you? These wagons take so long to unload. I did set up our, obviously you saw it, I did set up ourselves a little bit of an auto drive thing going on. Which is nice. Oh. Oh. I thought, she, I thought it was going to pull up and do it. There we go. I can't wait to get cows on this farm. Should we try and get ourselves some cows this episode? Or this uh, stream? What do you guys think? You wanna see you wanna see some cows in these in these uh on this farm? Are you not liking north? Oh we need a map figured out for a crossplay. 
Well, you guys could try the uh, Iowa Plains map, the update to Iowa Plains. Be cool. Oh, I bet, Jake. I bet that is quite a, quite a job. Oh yeah, Jesse, he does. He hauls. He not, he's not wasting time, these auto drive workers. Hey, doll. Good to see you, brother. Caught you on your break. Good deal. Yeah, it's awesome. Always good to see you guys catching streams. So let's see if this, uh, if the 4320 can uh, pull this, th this gale wagon. I believe. I believe. Time for cows? Alright, Aaron, Aaron. Maybe we'll, uh, maybe we'll have to get some Mookus in here. Stevenson. Hey, man. Good to see ya. Good morning to you. Always good to see members of the of the big rig. Daddy Frosty in here. Good to see ya, man. All right. Show me what you got. Yeah, look at that. She pulling. We just found ourselves in a bad spot in the field. That's it. That's all that was going on there. <laughs> She's spinning though. Look at those rear tires. Those things are spinning like something. Something else. Alright, so we got like a few more windrows to go. We shouldn't need to send the other box back. Hey, watchdog. Oh, why that thing just... Why did the fill plane just, like, fill up? That's stupid. How to do that? That's a lot of cows, Tyler. There's a whole lot of cows. If he if he's one popular fellow, I'll tell you that. One popular fella. I mean, how can you not be when you make some... When you make mods like he does. Oof. One talented guy. Yeah, you might need multiple barns there. How much are you going to make that... Uh, how much are you going to make that... Uh, updated cow barn hold Tyler <laughs> Hey Atlantic Dairyman, how are you? Hope you're doing well. Good to see you. And milk the bulls by hand. <laughs> Uh-oh. Jesse says, should we start the train? And there it goes. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate that. I didn't send this guy to the right place.
probably just pull this one back, right? Thanks for the five gifted, Jesse. Mojo, Simon, Greg, Brandon, Doinks. Enjoy the enjoy the memberships. We should have a early access of oh of Alma on the mat coming out this evening. Just one last finishing touch on the edit and we should be fine. Just ignore that you saw me just absolutely bruiser in our way through that gate. Oh yeah, you gotta, you gotta check out the content, like Jesse said. Hey, hit that like button too while you're here, everybody. In celebration of the of Jesse's five gifted, make sure you hit that like button. <laughs> the edit does have alfalfa on it, Benny, but if it's having or he's having the same issue that. Uh, you and Marv had at first when it doesn't or it doesn't like grow back, right? I think that was you and Marv, right? When you and Marv first came out, we were, they were having issues with it growing back or something, because you only could cut it like once or I don't know. Maybe I'm just full of it, but I think that's what the issue was. But yeah, it doesn't grow back right now. So we got our haylage done, huh? That's kind of nice. Get some, get some feed in there. It'll be good. We're just gonna pull this up right here for now. I, it is folded in. It's folded in. Oh, good deal, Marty. Good vibes. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, Marty. I'm all about the good vibes here. What we're all about here. Good vibes. So do we have hay up in the loft? I think we do. Yeah, it's just like really wide. Connor, Pleasant just linked it. Right above. Pleasant View just linked it. Where does you want you cut? You might have to retype that one there, Goatland Farmers. I am not sure what you're trying to say to me right now. Apologies, but hey, Duan. Happy Tuesday, sir. How are you, Duan Maker? I don't even know. I just like randomly just put things places. That's how dairy farmers do it, right? You just kind of you just kind of put stuff places. I'm just trying to be like a real dairy man. <laughs> Sorry if that offended any actual dairy farmers out there. I'm just joking. Oh, we don't. We need some music. That's what's. That's what's wrong right now. I was wondering what was why it was feeling so weird right now. We gotta get some music going. There we go.
series beat the piss out of it and never watch it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I could see that. Gotta figure out something to do with these like pastures here. I feel like I could like fit little little uh little pasture uh placeable pastures in those or something. They're kinda cool. I wonder if the small ones from Squatch would fit in there. Yeah, pretty much. Alright. Well, at least Dairyman agrees. At least one of the dairy farmers agrees. No. Uh, it's too small. Or too big. Or too small. We could combine them, though. We could do, like, one right here. Take this, take this fence out. Do one right here. Yeah, I couldn't do one right there. Doing right there though. Gotta figure out something to do with those. So, get cows or do we bale the hay quick? <laughs> oh yeah, there's some big old cow pies. There's some big old cow pies right in there. Yeah, we just ran over some soybeans, but. Oh my gosh. The guy's just got to move his tractor and it'd be a whole lot easier. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, oh, that'd be kind of cool. Yeah, that'd be a cool addition to the to those pastures. I know it. Just running over our crop. Who's this guy think he is? Some rich arable crop farmer? Some rich row cropper? Um, we have to check after we save, I guess. Get cows unbail? Okay. I just got to check to see, do we have hay in here at all? Um, we do have some hay. But I don't know if we have any hay in the loft. Is there a way to see that? Grass, grass silage, haylage. It's gonna take, it takes a long time to get this haylage though. That's what I'm kind of worried about getting cows. I'm not sure that it's gonna. I'm not sure that we're gonna have to have what it takes to feed them right now. All right, so let's get some cows in the tie stall for now. Where do I load these puppies up? You load them over here. I forgot. Right here. We're just going to buy them straight in, then, then haul them. Currently feeding the calves, are you? Bronchoma cow pasture would work great for those pastures. Does Bronchoma have pastures? I didn't know he did there, Eric.
Well, that's good, Toxic. Good deal. I do have Jonah's feed cart, yeah. Um, let's put some... We gotta put some milkers in here. We wanna go with... Ha Ooh. That's a good one. Do we wanna go with... Ha uh, Holsteins? Or do we wanna go with Brown Swiss? Or... I like to call them jerseys. Because they kind of look like jerseys, right? Kinda. I think everybody always does Holsteins. Let's go with these. Let's go with the Swisses. Let's do with a mix. I can dig that. Let's go with 30 or no, let's go with 25. All right. Hey, I like it. I like it guys. Let's go with 25 Browns. Let's go with four or 20 Holsteins. Oh, don't have enough money for the Holsteins. These girls are not happy right now. Girls aren't happy with me. They're really mooing a lot at me. Swiss and Holstein? Okay. Alright, I like it. Everybody, uh... Everybody's on board with the mix. I dig that. Um, we're going to cheat a little bit of money in. Because we're still getting set up. So we are going to cheat a little bit of money in. So I want to get 20 of these guys as well. One lonely Holstein in here in the pack. So that should large tie stall. I don't know who Molly is, but all right. So let's see. Let's do some feeding. Butter fat from the Swiss and quantity from the Holsteins. I love it, Toxic. I hope you enjoy that. To Court Farms is so much fun. I want to get chocolate wasted. Go for a mix of both, says Deader Line. Cool. Alright, I like it. I like I like that I got that, that feedback. I wouldn't have... Uh, I probably wouldn't have gone with a mix, to be honest with you. So, we need to go silo on... So we can pull from... The hat... Or no. Okay, so we need to pull this guy around. So this is how we feed. This thing is so sensitive. I gotta actually use my wheel. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. What are you doing? You're sure supposed to be able to get in here. There we go. So we really don't have a ton of grass silage right now. Yeah, we have ten feet. <laughs> ten feet of it. We might just be pulling... Hey, out. Mineral auger on. So then we go over here. Put some minerals in there. Then we turn that one off. Then we gotta turn the hay chute on. Do we have hay? That's the real question. 
We don't have hay. I swear we had hay. Alright, we gotta go cut ourselves some hay, guys. Gotta go cut ourselves some hay first. Unfortunately. So we'll go do that. Cool, it's a snack for the cattle. Yeah, it might keep them alive. This is this is built into the map, Goland. Hey Mitch. I'm just playing some farm sim, Mitch. Hey Newt, how are ya? Not used to it. Yeah, it's a lot different. It's a lot different, uh, Toxic Rabbit. But it's cool. I love, I love me some UK farming. I am not sure, Rabbit. I've been on a dairy farm in so long, I need to do a new city with dairy one of these days. Yeah. Maybe I could get you to play on, uh... Maybe I could get you to play on my big time dairy with me, Monty. I need some, I might, I might recruit some help to play on that. Hey, Dustin. My day's going good, man. Yeah, it's going good. Um, so we gotta do small squares. I'm just like losing my train of thought really bad right now. Yeah, I might recruit a few people to uh to help on the big dairy. But I got to I got to figure out some other options for some of the barns. So, I don't know. I'll get with you at some point. Can't get that. So we're going to we're going to go for the red wagon. Do you go with uh, dairy usually, Jesse? Yeah, it's good. Dairy is dairy is fun. You just for me, I just did so much of it early on in FS22 that I'm just like just yeah. Kind of starting to feel feel like I'm getting back into it, but now, do you guys like running big da big time dairies, or are you kind of like smaller? Smaller dairies, right? You know? You're like under a hundred head dairies? Or are you going like hundreds of head over thousands? Thousands is a lot in farm sim to take care of. Tried pigs, but I can't get into it. Yeah, I just feel like pigs aren't like super interactive. Like if I'm I'm hoping I'm hoping like I don't know. I just hope there's some more, still some more improvements on animals. You know? I don't know. Not a big livestock guy, new, huh? I know a lot of people aren't. I know a lot of people don't even touch animals on this game. Arable is the way that they usually go. I like doing a mix of both, so. 
The horse suck and sheep I've never touched. Yeah, I honestly haven't really touched sheep much either. Um, the only way that I would probably do sheep is if I'm on a UK map. I just don't, you don't, I don't know, I just don't see a whole lot of sheep around here. You can think of one sheep farm uh, that's near me. But other than that, that's pretty much the only sheep farm I know of. Not a dairy guy. I get lost with all different feeds. Let me try it though. You should Midwest. Yeah, I think you. I think. I think you should give it a try at least. It's just a lot of work. It's just a lot of extra work. It takes a lot longer to get through the years, with cutting hay and all that kind of stuff, chopping. You know. Yeah. Yeah, Jesse. It'd be cool. Under 100, 100 and small kid is always my favorite. Okay, screw him. Nice. Small dairy, 50 to 100, says Landon. Uh, I always start with the intention of staying small, then I'm going to end up 3 to 500. That's pretty big. Uh, it's pretty big. We were feeding... What what did we get up to on Midwest Dairy on that series? I think we were up to... 350 milking and that was just it just felt like with maze plus it felt like we were just constantly feeding yeah that's true rev that's a good thing to do because you're just doing corn and beans aren't you yeah exactly monty they're very time consuming oh that's pretty cool jesse very Canadian, you know, very Canadian having the reindeer, you know, up there, up there in the north. You know I mean, you're pretty much neighbors with, with, uh, uh, the North Pole, so. Makes sense that you have reindeer farms. I just love history. Yeah, I let, machine history, like, is pretty cool, toxic. I get, I can see why you enjoy that. I see a guy in Texas that ranches and has sheep in, oh, really, that's cool. Yeah, be on the lookout, Matt. Be on the lookout. It probably won't be until a, a month or so, or I don't know, but keep your eye out for it at least. Goat farms, okay. I don't think we see a ton of goats. Well, then you should try some. You should try some cattle out there, Newt. It gets you, it kind of it kind of breaks up the monotony of uh, of a row crop farming. Oh, on Instagram, I got you. Yeah, definitely, definitely got you, Matt. To do cows, and sometimes I'll just do. Yeah. Just whatever you're vibing with, you know? And sometimes the map will kind of tell you what what's good, too. I feel like. Sometimes the map just has a feel for a certain kind of farming. So. I don't know. Like, this map, obviously, has that dairy cow feel. That dairy feel. Uncle raises 200 head of sheep, and my cousin raises 400. Oh, that's cool, Brian. I mean, obviously, there's definitely sheep farms around, but I just, you know, you just don't see them a ton. Massey Ford, Fordson, David Brown, German Bill IH, Euro Style GD. A mixture is corn grist from little grist mill mud, beans, and tin. Oh, I like that. I like that mix. Rev, I think that's a really good hog mix. Dude has over a hundred acres fenced with a twelve foot chain. Ugh. That's so much fencing to maintain, Jesse. No thanks.
Yeah, I I have messed with it a little bit. I started messing with it a little bit uh, on the Midwest Dairy their Scroom. But by the time that I was kind of done doing that, I was just like burnt out on that farm. Hey, Slick Top, it's going good. Yeah, it's always a good day when I get to stream and talk to you guys. I get to hang out with you, you fellas. It's always a good day. Never a complaint from me. And he's got one single donkey. Nice. I like it, Benny. got to with the goat milk, you know. Goat milk. It's a real thing, Jesse. I feel like goat milk's starting to kind of become more of a popular dealio. I love goat cheese. You guys like goat cheese? Goat cheese is really good. Very acquired taste, though. You don't like it, you don't like it. Did you have to edit it to get that? Yeah, yeah, I think he did edit it, uh, Benny, yeah. Oh, Benny, he already responded to you. Closest we got to cattle farming was my brother worked for Lothrop Livestock. But they are just a quarantine station. Oh, okay. Not a lot of, not a lot of cattle farms out by you, Midwest, or? We're never going to get to see the dog. I think Simsation would love him. Oh, Simnation. He's sleeping downstairs. Colin. They probably would love him, but... He's downstairs. He decided to not come hang out with me today. That would be cool, Jesse. I would love to see a little bit more interaction with chickens... Make the chicken manure, like, super strong, too. <laughs> it feels like chicken manure is just, like, the prime time manure, you know? So many guys, like, pay so much, such good money for manure, for chicken litter. It's crazy, and it smells so bad. We should put a dog channel in, shouldn't we? Maybe, we, maybe we'll have to do that. People can post pictures of their pets. I love I love seeing pictures of people's pets. Ooh, that sounds really good, Riff. So what else is on that then? So a toasty is like uh it's like toast, isn't it? Essentially. Just bread, toast toasted bread. You just call it a toasty. Or is that a sandwich? I forget what the slang is means. For toasty. There are. Oh, okay. I got gotcha. you. Midwest. I had goat's milk when making. Oh, do you? Nice. That's a good way to uh, add or kind of add the uh, moisture into your bread. Don't do a lot of milk with bread, though. I mean, I know it's popular with some recipes, but I've never used milk in my bread.
yeah it is cool to see all that uh all the dairy farms and stuff i was just driving over in coopersville we had to go to muskegon i don't know if anybody i'm sure somebody might leave a comment that watches this but uh we were going over to muskegon for a funeral for my wife's aunt and great aunt uh we were driving through Coopersville. Driving through Coopersville is pretty sweet here in Michigan because there's a lot. It's really flat, and you can just see the the dairy farms for miles, the staves and the harvest store silos and in just hanging up in the in the background. It's kind of cool. The stuff. Uh, it's the worst. Chicken litter is the worst. In in the there's a farm right by me that it's like a it's a just a row crop farm that buys it in from the big uh, Herbrux the big chicken farm near me and they just pile it in the field and it just smells terrible for days if they don't spread it right away. Oh yeah, that I bet that's awful, Jesse. I've never smelt that, but yeah, that's probably awful. No, do they, Dustin? I don't know if I've really smelt turkey turkeys much. Wish we could grab chickens. Oh, that sounds delicious, Rev. Hey, no worries, dairy man. No worries. Chicken litter is good for tomatoes. Interesting, Ethan. Maybe I'll need to look in that into that for my garden this year. I'm looking to have a nice bountiful garden this year this was my first last year was my first year gardening and i did tomatoes and just i just did tomatoes and potatoes my potatoes turned out excellent really great obviously i mean potatoes are pretty easy to grow pretty low maintenance my tomatoes were kind of small but they were so good like they were super flavorful my mouth is kind of watering just talking about those tomatoes they were so good I would really like to do a lot more vegetables this year. I really enjoyed having a garden. So interesting. Good to know, Ethan. Thanks for the tip. I'm sure I could get some chicken litter from somewhere. Fun you do to OTM and Alma. Don't get to live stream much, but I just want to say thank you. Oh, thanks, Jeff. That's really kind of you. I'm happy that you found the channel, man. And thank you for... Just stopping in quick and saying, saying hey, and letting me know that. That's really cool. Hope you get. Hope you're still enjoying that series. I know I'm loving it. I know I'm still really loving that series. All right, we need to find a tractor to pull the. Uh, I guess we'll use the farm all. See if the farm all will pull her. I bet. I bet that's disgusting, Jesse. No worries, Logan. Have a good uh, day in class, or have a good class. Thanks for stopping by, I appreciate it. Always good to see ya. Oh yeah, beans, dev or cucumbers for sure I do want to grow. I want to pickle them, or I want to do... You guys ever done like a... Uh, my mom did this like every summer when I was little. She would take cucumbers and just put them in vinegar and with some onion, white onions as well. 
and it's just so good. And it would kind of just like, it was just like kind of lightly pickle them. Then you just eat the cucumbers out of there. Oh, so good. Hey, we'll see you, Slick Top. Enjoy the rest of your day. Hour and a half left. You're almost there. Hey, morning, Fender. Fender. Morning, man. How are you? And Fender is is the champion of Own the Map, by the way. My man Fender is just killing it right now. He wants that. He wants that Own the Map prize. Oh, that's interesting, Jesse. I feel like that's just like really hard to find though. That's kind of would be the only thing. I feel like just <laughs> be be really difficult to find something like that, I feel like. Hey, Suzette. Welcome in. Oh man, yeah. Tomatoes. Oof. Garden fresh tomatoes. Oof. The work just pays out. I even the even the potatoes I bought were like incredible. Make a spicy dill pickle spears, and they're my favorite. If I'm not careful, I'll eat a whole shot. At least it's not the worst thing for you, Benny. At least it's not the worst thing. Have I seen the new 66 series coming out? I have not, Suzette. Oh. Tell me about it. Who's making it? Oh, isn't it EY? Isn't EY making it? This is large H's, Duilo. Dilulo. Dilulo. I think that's how you say it. Large H did the edit. Oh. That would be a kind of a cool idea, wouldn't it, Benny? I think that's actually a really cool prize. Something like that? If I can get Pleasant to sign it. Maybe we'll both sign it. Bioline commercially sold. Okay. I'll, I'll look into that, Jesse. That's a, actually really good to know. I have played Red Dead Redemption 2, Rubber Duck, yeah. Not a ton, but I did play it a little bit. That'd be a wall hanger, heck yeah. By Shabin? Oh, okay, so is that nice? Oh yeah. Who just put a did somebody put up a review video of it or something? I just saw, maybe. Nice Landon. Cherry tomatoes are delicious as well. Although I, I feel like I do, I, I would rather eat a like a slice of tomato than a cherry tomato. Like the biting into a whole cherry tomato, the texture of it kind of bothers me a little bit. Okay, screw them. Nice. I don't think I've ever had a pickled. Ah, uh, green bean. Here you go, Benny. I think that'd be cool. Like, I think, I think you might have just come up with the own the map prize. I think that might just be what we have to do.
What's your favorite, uh, what, what kind of fishing do you do there, uh, Scrum? I feel like any time I ever go fishing, it's just kind of for crappies and... Crappies and, uh, bluegill. Usually. Love me. Love me a good bluegill fish fry. Whew. The Lulo. Italian. Sounds Italian. That'd be cool, Benny. Well, your own sweet corn. I just don't feel like I have enough garden space. So I built a raised garden bed last year. Um, so I feel like I would have to do some in-ground gardening if and find some space for it. I just feel like the deer would just destroy any sort of uh, sweet corn crop that I would grow. We got we got deer all over the place by us. Bluegill is some fantastic eating. You are correct. May as well donate a red hat to balance it out. Yeah. Could do a red. I need. I need to. Ah, gosh. I just want to get down to it. The, pretty much, really, the main reason why I want to go to a farm show is to get some cool hats. <laughs> I gotta get me some. Gotta get me some free hats. Crappies are your favorite. Nice. This will this will probably come out eventually, Suzette. Yeah. No no date. I just bought some three year sharp cheddar cheese. Oh. And Angie from and it's Wisconsin cheese, dude. You're living the good life right now. You might have to if it's really that good. You may have to bring me some home when you come when you come back someday, whenever that is. Actually, probably the next time we see you will be uh, when we go out there. I mean, I have plenty of space, Benny. I have a I I have an acre and a half. At my house, but we built a fence in my backyard for my dog and just my daughter and stuff to play in. And I put my raised bed out there and it seemed to do really good at keeping the critters out besides the rabbits. The rabbits were able to get in somehow and they ate a few of the tomatoes, but not a ton. And I'd like to keep any garden inside my fence if I could, but... I don't know, maybe we'll try some sweet corn outside the fence, see if it see if the deer do just destroy it or not. Yeah, yeah, Jesse, it's awesome. Need some sim station hats, I don't know. I don't know if we're to that point yet, Monty, that we're gonna be making making merch. <laughs> maybe how about this? I'll I'll put out a sim station hat when we get to ten thousand subs. Maybe that can be our goal. Wisconsin local, what cheese do you need? Oh, my brother, my brother FS Farmer C there, he's a, he's now a Wisconsin local as well, so I'm sure he'll be able to supply me with some. We had, uh, he always brings me back, or he brought me back some spotted cow uh, last time he came home. That was good. I mean, I've had spotted cow before, but oh, that's always a good beer. You brought, The wine that you brought mom and dad home was really good, too. That was really good. <laughs> hey, Fox Farms, how are you? How are you enjoying the server, Fox? I think that's the same Fox Farms as in, in Discord. Toxic, I don't have a, I don't have a command. 
<laughs> maybe we can, uh, maybe Monty or somebody could post a link. Maybe if Pleasant's here, I don't know. Somebody could post another link. Or if you scroll up, you could probably get, get a, because Ple Tyler or Pleasant View did post a link earlier. Spry fish emulsion on the sweet corn. That'll keep the deer back. Or spray fish emulsion. Okay. Man, you know a lot about your uh, your gardening stuff there, Jesse. Goat milk bread is quite wet. Going in the oven, uh, oat flour, honey, sea salt, flaxseed, lemon juice, olive oil, baking pot. Huh. Maybe I'll need to look it up. Look up a recipe there, Bob. Don't like cinnamon, red pepper flakes, cayenne, and shaved Irish spring soap. Interesting. <laughs> shaved Irish spring soap. What's in the Irish spring soap that they don't like? Hey, we'll see you, Landon. Thanks for stopping by, buddy. Have a good Tuesday. Appreciate you. No, I don't. I, have a, I don't have a tractor real life, Suzette. Listen, Sim Farms. What the heck? This guy is a resident Michigander, and he doesn't even... And he comes in here with that crap. That'll get you banned. That'll get you banned here. Hold me accountable. Okay. <laughs> New object. Get you to 10k subs. Yeah. God's country. Welcome to Wisconsin. 12, 15 to buy a load up when he comes. Yeah, I'd probably, I mean, we probably will. <laughs> I'm looking forward to taking the ferry. I think we're going to take the ferry there and then drive around to get back. Work in New Glarus where they, Bruce Spotted Cow. Oh, that's awesome, Screw. Oh, yeah. New Glarus, or Spotted Cow is the bee's knees. It's right up there with uh, Yingling for me. Can't wait to get down to Florida and have some angling for uh, on spring break. If you put hair from haircuts or ashes from a fire pit around your garden, it helps keep animals. Oh, okay, Dustin. I got a lot of hair, so maybe uh, at the uh, at the barber, I'll ask him if he can bag up my hair for me. I don't I'll put it around there. <laughs> nice, Fox. Thanks, Monty. Appreciate you, buddy. Don't like the smell of it. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, I know it. That dude, that dude's about to get banned. I'm a Niners fan for 40 years now. All right. Well, listen. Come in here with that kind of stuff. That's dangerous. That's a dangerous simulation. Gotcha, Toxic. Replenish your stock of it. We See, we can't get Yingling here in Michigan. It sucks. There's a dis there's a channel in my Discord rev that is like UK UK mods that you could post in there. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for the plug, Monty. No, it's Michael. That's Michael that's doing seed, Fox. I'm just have the co-op. So if you nobody has been it looks like everybody's got bin so, so maybe my idea isn't gonna go too well. My plan was to just be able to buy your guys' crop straight off the field for a higher price. And then I could sell it at peak price for a, for a little bit more of a profit, but it looks like everybody's really got bins. Yeah, yeah, we're Lions fan simulation. Huge Lions fans. 
I've been a Lions fan my whole life, even through 0-16. Fucking fighting words, yeah he is. Oh yeah, that's a bummer, Benny. Tegan. <sighs> yeah, yeah, you guys. You guys in your Niners fandom. I don't really know who I'm rooting for. Honestly, I'm not really rooting for anybody, so. Yeah, they, but some of the bins these guys built are massive for what they have for land, <laughs> Jesse. Hey, we'll see you, Monty. Thanks for hanging out, buddy. Appreciate you. Always good to see you. Yeah, we did choke. You should have won that game. There's no excuses. We just blew it. Not going to watch? Yeah, I, I don't know. I probably won't really pay mu too much of attention to it. Oh, you're going to see a whole lot of T-Swift. Honestly, I'm probably just going to root for the Chiefs just because I like the Kelsey Bros. And I really enjoy their podcast. So, that's really it. And the Niners beat us, so I don't really want to root them, root for them. the lion's way not the new lions i refuse i refuse to say that we are still that way refuse you're going to the super bowl that's freaking sweet good for you dude that's awesome Yeah, I would have really loved to see a Chiefs-Lions Super Bowl because it just would have been, kind of been cool. The first game of the year and the last game of the year is the Lions versus Chiefs. That's kind of a cool little thing, right? But It's all right. Hopefully we can uh, make a push for it again next year. I know how hard it is to do that, but hopefully we can uh, continue to be good. Hopefully our new OC will be solid. Because it's pretty, it's a pretty foregone conclusion that uh, BJ is going to Washington. I think. <laughs> it's being a Lions fan. It's true. Being a Lions fan has been very painful my whole life. Yeah, it's rough. But it was so much. Like this year was so much fun to actually have a winning Lions team like that was awesome Cowboys fan I'm sorry John that's too bad <laughs> I joke I joke Then there's being a Bears fan. What's going on? Oh, jeez. Uh oh. 
Okay, what's happening with the auto load? Oh, jeez, that's not what we're... Oh, goodness gracious, what's going on? I think things are going very south right now. We're just going to keep going until it just blows up. Perfect response for John, yeah. Uh, I think I'm going to actually keep that right side for uh, grass work, Jesse. Because I'm thinking that we're going to turn that uh, field that we had as a pasture that was one of the original pastures. We're going to turn that into another pasture for the steers. Yeah, I did accidentally hit the unload button. Oh, that's awesome, Bob. That's very cool. Do you love near? Do you live near London? That's awesome. The bail stuck under the running gear. Oh. I think there is still a bale stuck under the running gear. Uh oh, look at that. There is. Good thing good thing you said that, Fender. I don't think I would have looked. Steelers fan, Trace. Okay. You know, the Steelers actually weren't as bad as I thought they might be this year. You guys need a new quarterback, though. Kenny Pickett is not it. Well, you guys, at least you guys have won a Super Bowl recently, Graham. Uh, I have not had a look at it yet, Simulation, but if I end up making videos on this save, I think I'm going to. I think I might add it to this. Yeah, we'll take a look at the equipment here shortly, Suzette. GM Modding's Itch. Nice root rig for us. Oh, that's cool, Jesse. I got the I got the dozer from uh, Rockin' Ranch. I think it's a Komatsu dozer, and that's what I used. And it acts like, you can like push trees down and stuff. GM modding though, I'll have to look. I'm gonna look that up right now actually. I've never heard of them. Wow, they have a lot of... You got a lot of equipment. Dang. Did you look at that? Would you look at that? Oh yeah, Pickens was a huge disappointment. Because they don't have a quarterback to throw to him. Give him a quarterback and I think he'll be fine. It's like uh, Devontae Adams for me this year. 
just didn't have a quarterback. And he just... He was a shell of what he was last year with Derek Carr. Yeah, you did, Dustin. Yeah, that was that's true. Hopefully you guys can... Uh, hopefully uh, Bryce Young can come around. He's not looking great for the number one pick. Not looking great. Two and a half hour trip to Dublin Airport and about an hour flight to London and brought my kids over. That's awesome, Bob. That's very cool. The fact that you've been to five of six, too, that's really cool. You're a big, big NFL fan, huh? We're almost done, finally, and then we can go feed some cows. Because they're going to need it. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. i got to add my protein bar here. Yeah, we had a bit of an issue with the uh, with the hay uh, the the hay rack here, Tyler. A wee bit of an issue, mate. See what I'm thinking, Tyler, is that you and uh, you and uh, Ryan should just play on my big old dairy farm with me. play that together and maybe even make some videos on it that'd be kind of fun do like a little bit of a buck grant type of a video that'd be kind of fun yeah he's looking pretty good How do I get an invite? Private, it's got a lot of private mods in there, simulations, so. A lot of private, pleasant view mods, so. Unfortunately, a select few that have those mods are the only ones, uh, that are probably gonna get an invite. You're the you're you you are the G Portal King now. I am, yes. I am. Oh that's cool, Bob, yeah. It's not great uh timing for the UK to watch <laughs> football games. Oh, Doug. Doug, Doug, Doug. Coming back with the forty nine ninety nine three Three streams in a row. Dude. Thank you. Good to see you, buddy. Hopefully you're having a good day today. Appreciate you. Sugar Dougie. Yeah, it's my Sugar Dougie. Coming in. Thanks, buddy. You're nuts, dude. You're nuts. Thank you, buddy. 
How are you doing today? You having a good day? What are you up to? You running you running some uh, machinery today, Doug? Sugar Dougie in the house. All right, we guess now we just need to drive by these bales and get it. Uh... I know, I know. I was so, sh I was so shook that I missed that I missed the missed the windrow. Just don't mind those bales going under the baler. I don't know why I'm getting so close. But. Yeah, Stone Valley. Tyler. I'm having a lot of issues with it though, dude. Like every time I load in, it like, it, it like freaks out. Like all my controls start freaking out. Cause I was thinking maybe about streaming that one today, but I don't know. I had that. I was having issues, and I was like, I don't, I don't want to mess with it. Could put, could build one on uh, Midwest. Don't you miss Midwest? Well, there's turned nice for a week, so I'm on the greater cutting roads for yet another subdivision. Oh boy, that sounds like a blast. Yeah, that's what it is, Jesse. Good old subdivisions. Taking out farmland. Sad sight. We need to get ourselves a uh, power washer, don't we? Good thing there's an old inner... What is this? Oh. Well, that's the dealer. Where should we put this? Like over here. Does it do it for you too, Tegan? Okay, that's great to know that I'm not the only one. Oh, I'd be up to I'd be up to changing it up, buddy. That's what you want to do. If you want to if you want to throw in your new dairy barn, I'm down, dog. Nice simulation. I replaced all the uh the grass on my version with uh um, the seasonal grass, seasonal foliage grass, looks really nice. Oh, I like that idea too. Maybe we'll have to throw one over there too, Jesse. You can put two. We're going to back the baler into the shed. Need some, need some routine maintenance. This baler does. I don't know why, but let's just say it does. I'm going to back her into the shop here.
Yeah, it's not bad, Benny. If you want to, you can message me on Discord and I can help you through it. Um, oh yeah, we gotta go feed. We gotta do some feed now that we have some hay. We put way too much manure feed in there, didn't we? And not enough silage. We're just gonna feed them hay. Whatever. Oh, well, we also didn't change the recipe either, so there's that too. Yeah, we might have to tweak some recipes here. How do we load this puppy up from the mixer? Isn't that sweet? Isn't this feed setup just so cool? Oh! That's a bit screwy, isn't it? These textures aren't working very good. That's pretty slick, huh? Oh, I think the keyboard is broke. No, yeah, it's definitely it definitely happens for me too, Tegan. So you're not alone, man. The shop is very nice, isn't it? H does such a good job decorating his shops. Uh, it's a blast, all right. I'll start the sewer main later this week. 28 to 30 foot cuts at the start. But it's shallow to about 18 within the first 150 feet or so. I'll be on this project for a while. Fun stuff. Fun stuff, Doug. Hey, we'll see you later, Watchdog. Thanks for being here, buddy. Have a good day at work. Always good to see you. Hey, Gary. Like what you added to James? Yeah, they do. But Wembley, no, they're not... Off that hard concrete. Listen, we have to. Uh, do they have bedding? I thought they. I thought if we put some uh, hay in the hayloft, they'd have. See, they have straw. They have bedding. It just doesn't show up. These guys are really, really uh, fiending for some good feed right now. Yes, it is. I think I think it's going to be released, Gary. <sighs> True that, Jesse. <laughs> no, not really. We didn't really do much of an equipment tour, Suzette. Uh, we can run through it. We got a 1586, a skins deer here. 2955 over there, 4440. A series John Deere, a 5020, 7720. Deer Baylor, Bagger, 4320. And a uh, disc mine. That is pretty much it. Yeah, for sure, Gary. That's, a, that's always nice. You end up scrolling through Marketplace. Uh oh. That's not good. Alright, so I know this isn't very 90s, guys, but I think we're going to buy a wrapper, a bale wrapper.
Just pretend it's an older bail wrapper. It's a good map too, Gary. And I, I enjoy that map as well. I have not downloaded the update though. The one where he added new roads and stuff. I have not downloaded that. <laughs> yeah, hit that like button, everybody. We, you know the goal. 100 likes. We always end up short. Just a little bit short. It's just so much work to get, uh, get bales made and feed made and all that stuff. It's a lot of work. Yeah, that would be cool. There, with the uh, Goveal pack or whatever, Benny, there is one. There is a stationary one. But it's like a European style, you know? I don't think Goveal is very present, if at all, in in America. Yeah, it does. It takes a long time with the small equipment. Yep. It's a big job. I really love that hay law or that hay uh shoot. Really a big fan of that. You growing in that barn they need cameras. I don't know. SKH. You just you just like to see how full the loft is, you know? Not sure what H is planning on putting in there, but we're just putting hay, you know. Gotta keep all the the crazies out. Oh yeah, it makes him feel massive. You can't. You can't trust these people these days. They're all they're all corrupt. I'm just joking. Oh, we left the do we left the twenty nine going? All right, so is this hay or is this? Is this grass? What is this? Oh, this is hay. I really don't want to do more grass cutting, but I feel like we need to. Oh, the paint chips. There we go. We could do that. Yeah, it is nice. Up here. It is a nice touch, isn't it? That kind of grass. Yeah, I knew that's what he was getting at. Benny. Should we do some chopping? Some silage chopping? I don't know. I don't know what we should do. I only got 13 minutes left and I'm probably going to be streaming, so... I'd like to put some... I'd like to put some cows 
So this is cool, right? So this is pretty this is pretty slick about this uh barn. So if you put where do we put the cows in over here? So you put the cows in here. So say we wanted some more milkers. You can put them in over here. Oh, okay. You can put them in here. And then it's like connected. Like to the tie stall where you can milk them. So they can go through the little alley here. If we can get this gate opened. I don't know if we can, I think we can open that gate eventually. Yeah, see? We can run them through the alley. Maybe. I don't know if this one opens though. But you get the gist, right? Well, that would, that would kind of... Put a damper on things, wouldn't it? Anyway, so there's this side, right? And then you can also put cows over here. So we can put our heifers over here. Do we get like 20 heifers? a few other heifers over here 40 heifers and these guys go go out in the pasture as well as oh i don't know if they hang out in here but they go out in the pasture that's pretty cool isn't it yeah Rubber mats, yeah, it would be cool. I want to see these rubber mats, Tyler. You got to show them to me. Yeah, I know, uh... I know Legacy has sand... He implemented sand bedding in his, like, dairy, cow, barn, pasture thing. Placeable. Somehow. But yeah, that would be interesting. So this is also a CCM bag as well. So we can go up to this with a bucket and it loads it with CCM. It's just pretty much a buy point. I thought it was kind of cool. So I'm thinking when we feed these guys, we'll probably have to come all the way over here, get some hay in. from this barn. I'm very tempted to put uh, hay in uh, in that other like lean-to side this barn. Very tempted to put hay there. Sawdust would be kind of cool. You could like create sawdust from wood and you can use it from bedding. That'd be kind of slick. Hey yo, Midwest farmer with the fiber. Thank you, buddy. Oh, we pulled up too close, or we didn't pull up far enough. Thanks for the fiber, dude. Thank you, thank you. That's. A lot of gifted gifted memberships. We are actually over a 200 now. So the last stream, when we thought we hit 200, we only hit 190. So now with the with the gifted five from Jesse and the gifted five from Midwest, we are actually at 200. 
over 200 now. Thank you, buddy. Logan, Trace, Paul, Joshua, and Atlantic Dairyman. Enjoy those memberships. I would just make that old barn auto load bales and it would hold more. Yeah, that'd be cool. Pleasant. No, it's probably my internet. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. Whoa. This tractor does not want to pull this right now. What's your deal there, Mr. Tractor? You did. Glitching. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. Better now? All right, it was everybody. Yeah, we may have lost connection for a second. Good old Starlink. Let's see if we, we need to buy a bucket for this skid loader. All right, good. Good deal. Good to hear it's better. I think it would be cool to have separate connected to the slurry pit. Separator connected to the slurry pit. That way you could take the dry that comes. Use it as bedding for cows. Yeah, that would be kind of cool, wouldn't it, Doug? <laughs> Ain't ready for that kind of rules. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like, kind of like what Jesse said. I mean, you can separate your manure already with bumps and hoses, so... How do we fill this? Isn't there a way? Oh, right there. We have to buy... We have to buy it? We have to dump in there. So we still have to dump... You have to dump something in there? It doesn't say we do. Let's see if there's a trigger. Anybody ever use these bags? They're like the CCM bags. They're these. You have a f CCM bag and you have a wet cake bag. I thought the wet cake storage for barley. So we have to have barley. We have to put barley into these. We have to do CC. Oh, interesting. Okay. Okay. So we don't have any barley. Maybe we have to plant a gra or a field of barley and go harvest that quick. What field could we put into barley? Maybe we go by forty-five. Turn that into barley quick. Uh, let's do another hundred thousand. Other end silly, ain't it? No. 
Giants can't do shit. We need. We do need Pleasant to take over Giants, don't we? Massive money saver. I bet it was, Doug. Ah, uh, yeah, it's like a million times better, J&M. Starlink is way, way, way better. That's what I had. Or no. I had uh, a different satellite. Well, I guess I don't know about cable. Because I guess I had a satellite internet. I know, I'm cheating right now. But I want to try those bags out. Uh, I found them on King Mods. Sim, Sim Farms. A subway sandwich? <laughs> Was what a subway sandwich? <laughs> oh yeah, I bet. Because sand just gets into everything. Doesn't make sense. Listen, listen. We're not so completely set up yet. We're just like working... We're working on getting this farm set up for a possible series there, Tyler. Bust out the old combine. Hey, Heath. Welcome in. Good to see you again. Oh, it looked like a Subway sandwich. Ah, I see. Yes, it kind of did, didn't it? If only I had easy. Wouldn't that be nice? Wouldn't it be nice if we all had easy deb and IRL? Yeah, like what Benny said, it's just the government helping out. Another extended lunch. Yeah, there you go, Russell. Or are you telling me? Yes, another extended lunch for me? Yeah. <laughs> I have to get lost in Detroit for use equipment. Yeah. It's true. Oh, we forgot our bail that we uh, left over here the other day. I'm here to help. Amen. Of, amen. Of, amen to that, Benny. Yeah, there's one on the uh, King Mods there, Heath. I, I like that idea, Pleasant. I think... I think you should... Uh, yeah, I like that idea. Because I feel like that you, you already did so much work to that bar and you might as well keep it. Just add on to it a little bit. Make it look nice. That first dairy build that you had over on like the big dairy farm. Like the main farm on Elma before. Was, was solid. That was a really good build. I don't, want, I don't know why the crop destruction is like so weird on this. It's like completely taking it out. Okay. 
All right, I gotta. I feel like I need to get off. I gotta get back to work. It's a little bit past. I wanted to get a little bit of this done, but maybe we'll. Uh, maybe we'll uh, do it the next stream. We'll we'll uh, harvest this and we'll do some chopping. So. Or stinky hog farm. I know. Dude. You're the man. You're the man, Doug. Appreciate you, buddy. He's gone. Frozen in stutter. Oh, I... Listen. I'm back. I'm back. We'll see you guys. See you, Fender. See you, Tegan. See you, Rev. Jesse. Aaron. Hey, thanks, Aaron, for the, uh, for the donation as well to start off the stream. I appreciate you, dude. Thank you, thank you. We'll see you guys. See you, Bob. Trace. All right. I'm outie. Catch you guys later. See you Thursday.